This video shows how to extract songs from CDG discs into CDG and MP3 files in a PC. Note that the extraction requires a DVD RW drive, meaning read and write, rather than a DVD ROM drive which can only read the discs. Extracting a disc is a basic step and can be done in many different ways. For example, you can use the CAVS 205G USB player instead of a PC or use any one of the many programs such as the CAVS MCG program in a PC. We show these alternative ways in the video how to load songs of CDG discs into an external device for playing in CAVS 205G USB karaoke machine. Here we are going to use the program called Audio Graver. To download and install the program, open a browser such as Google Chrome and go to Audio Graver. Follow the site instructions to download the program. We select the free version. Download is very quick and when done, click on the downloaded file to start the installation. Some of the next screens are written in German, so take care to install the program only and decline other promotional programs. When done, close the browser and start the audio grabber program. Close the pop-up of the tip of the day and go to Settings at the top. Go to General Setting. There select the folder into which the extracted files will be saved. For us, we select E Drive, Video Instructions, CAVS, 205G, How to Extract Songs from a CDG Disc, Karaoke Songs. This selection of destination folder is important as users often don't know where the files went after the extraction. Next important setting is how the extracted files will be named. Here we select track number, track name which is title, and artist in that order. We also select to make a subdirectory for each disk by album name. For other options such as to remove the leading or trailing silence, we leave the default values unchanged. Close the setting by pressing OK. Next go to MP3. Most of the settings are left unchanged from default. Among them is the option to delete the WAV file after making the MP3 file. Also is an option to enable the ID3 tag on the extracted MP3 files. For bitrate, we select constant bitrate at 128 Mbps, which is normally accepted as professional quality. Close the MP3 window by pressing OK. We are now ready for extraction. Insert a CDG disk into the DVD RW drive. The song list will appear in the audio grabber. Note that the title and artist information also appear automatically thanks to the audio grabber that collects the information from online public server with a disk ID. Next press the CD at the top. Select Grab CDG Tracks Karaoke, then grab CDG plus compressed file. The extraction will begin. You can see the progress of the extraction by looking at how many songs are extracted and how many songs are left. When the extractions of songs are completed, the compression to make the MP3 files will begin. Do not interrupt the extraction process until the compression is completed, which is shown at the bottom of the encoding pop-up window. When the compression is done, the screen will automatically change back to the song list of the disk. To start extracting another disk, replace the disk in the DVD drive. The song list of the new disk will appear in the audio grabber. Again, press the CD at the top and select Grab CDG Tracks Karaoke, 
then grab CDG plus compressed file. The extraction will begin. Here we continue to extract three disks. When done, close the audio graver program. Let's now go to the destination folders in which the extracted files are saved. Open the file explorer. In our case, go to E drive, video instructions, CAVS 205G, how to extract songs from a CDG disk, karaoke songs. We find three folders according to the album names of the three disks we extracted. Go into each one and we find the extracted song files, one CDG and one MP3 files for each song. The song files are named by track number, track name, which is a title, and artist, each separated by a dash. This completes the video instruction on how to extract the songs of CDG disk into CDG and MP3 files in a PC.